Bell Gas Educational Series. Our intention is to help educate on a range of information, from basic to technical. Our goal is to add value and support to our distributors, customers, and community. This episode will focus on commercial regulators. Let's get started. Regulators, as mentioned in our What Are Regulators video, are defined as devices for controlling fluid flow. Bell Gas commercial regulators are ideal for natural gas service regulators such as retail and restaurants, as well as fuel gas regulators for compressors and engines. Pictured here are examples of installed commercial regulators. The one on the left is at a bakery, and the one at the right is at a restaurant. Now let's take a look at how commercial regulators work. As higher pressure gas moves into the body, the rising downstream pressure pushes against the diaphragm, balancing the spring force. As the diaphragm assembly raises from increased pressure, it lifts the lever which moves the seat towards the orifice. The downstream pressure and spring force meet at the regulator set point. Next, we will discuss the different types of commercial regulators that Bell Gas manufactures. Bell Gas offers several products that can be used in commercial applications. Our base platforms are the 200 and 300 series regulators. Optional features include pilot operated, integrated monitor, integrated slam shut, and enhanced relief. Now let's take a look at each type. Starting with the P200, the P200 is a large diaphragm commercial regulator used for low pressure delivery. The benefit of the large diaphragm allows consistent pressure through your flow range. You can find this type of regulator at multi-unit apartment complexes, mid-rise buildings, small to medium gas engines and compressors, and high volume restaurants, just to name a few. Next we have the P300. The P300 is a small diaphragm commercial regulator used for low pressure delivery. It is versatile because of its wide range of port sizes. You can find this type of regulator at condominiums, small buildings, small shops, and restaurants. Now let's take a look at a pilot operated regulator. A pilot operated regulator is a regulator with a supplementary device called a pilot used to increase accuracy and flow of a regulator. These can often be found in high volume and or fixed factor metering applications. Another type of commercial regulator is an integrated monitor regulator. A monitor regulator system is made up of two regulators. Both regulators sense the same downstream pressure, however, the primary regulator is the working regulator. The monitor regulator serves as a backup if the primary regulator fails. Next are integrated slam shut regulators. These commercial regulator safety devices are backup safety options that work alongside regulators acting immediately during an over or under pressure event. The unique feature of this regulator is that the slam shut is built into the body of the regulator. When the device is activated, it closes and remains shut until it is manually reset. Last on our list is an enhanced relief regulator. An enhanced relief regulator is a relieving regulator with an optimized design to maximize the relieving capabilities in an overpressure situation. This concludes our What Are Commercial Regulators episode, a part of the Bell Gas Educational Series. We hope you learned the basics and more about Bell Gas commercial regulators. If you like this video and are interested in more videos like this, like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you have any questions or need support, please call or email our engineering and customer service teams located in Newell, West Virginia. If you need more information, visit bellgas.net and make sure you are following us on LinkedIn. Thank you and goodbye. Hello and welcome to the Bell Gas.